Hi, my name is Vic Veer. I'm an ENT consultant surgeon that works in the NHS in England. And if you want that translated into American, I think that means I'm an attending, although I'm not entirely sure what that means. Now, if you're watching this video, I really think you ought not to be, because really this video has very little educational potential. And if you want to see something of value, I'd browse through my videos. There are videos about how to help yourself with snoring and sleep apnea and other things like earwax and tonsils and things like that. This video, on the other hand, is just a rambling message and most of it is for me to say thank you so much to all of you out there. By the time I've managed to edit this video and get it out there as quickly as I possibly can, I think I'll be almost at 10,000 subscribers, which to me is a mind-boggling amount of people. I can't believe it really. I said to myself when I started this a few months ago that if I get to 1,000, I'd be really happy and everything past that would be a bonus. So thank you all for all your love and your support to get me to this point. It's really appreciated. Thank you so much. So many of you will know that I started this channel in the middle of the coronavirus pandemic and it was sort of my way of trying to escape from the situation. You see, ENT is a quite a gentlemanly sport. All I do is help people with their snoring and sleep apnea, sometimes help them clear out infections in their ears or clean out wax and things like that. It's not like the coronavirus at all. Because we're ENT surgeons, we get classed as airway surgeons and therefore we got pulled into the coronavirus pandemic to help people to help people breathe when they couldn't really breathe for themselves. And I have to admit, I found it really personally very difficult to go into work, see 40, 50, 55 people each day, knowing that half of them will die that day, and then have to explain that to their, their wives, their husbands, their children, and then come back and do the same thing the next day. It was quite hard for me. And that's not to say I'm, I'm only a surgeon. There are people out there like the intensivists, the people who work in intensive care, the doctors and nurses that work there, had to do this all day. I could escape and fall asleep in my car in the car park, but they had to do it all day. And then also, I didn't lose any loved ones. I didn't lose my job. I was very lucky in a way, but pathetically, I still found it hard. And the way I sort of dealt with it was to do something creative or try to do something creative, make this YouTube channel so I could feel personally that I've done something good or positive that's come out of this. And I guess by the time you're watching this video, you will know that the intensive care beds in this country are starting to fill up again. Today, half my list was cancelled because there were no beds available in the hospital. And I guess I'm just going to have to go back and do it all over again, as many of us are going to have to. But I think I'm lucky because I've got my beautiful wife and kids to help me through this. I've got this YouTube channel as a creative outlet. I have the X event project which allows me to feel like I'm actually helping people with coronavirus. So hopefully that will help people around the world, particularly in areas like Bangladesh and India, where we're starting to make these things. I've almost finally finished writing my snoring app, which will hopefully be out in the next few weeks. And I also rather stupidly said to myself about a year ago that if I ever got to 10,000 subscribers, that I'll start writing my book again. And I'm a terrible writer, but I will try and get that book out. And the other thing I promised myself was that when I get to 10,000 subscribers, that I'd give away an Excite OSA device. In my videos, I've called it a snoozel device. Device. So what I've done was I've written in the names of the people who put their comments in that section in the uh, community tab. What I'm going to do is just circle randomly one of the names like that. I've got two names here. I've got Akraj Siguru and Ron the Welder. So I think it's more... Ugh. I'll, I'll put them both down. I think it's Ron the Welder, which is... A, I've got more of Ron the Welder on that. Um, I'll do one more in case those two people don't get back to me. And the, the third one is AJ. So if Ron doesn't pick up the phone to me or, or doesn't reply to my message, then I'll go to the next one, the next one. So um, that'd be great if I could sort of post you uh, one of these devices and you can have that for free on me. So that gesture is just a way of saying thank you to all of you. Thank you so much for watching and liking and commenting on my videos. I'll continue to try and make content that you find valuable. And I hope that um, I'll learn how to make videos as well. I'm still learning a lot and I'm sorry for the quality of my videos. I will get better with time. So thank you very much. Bye bye.